Question 27. The Great Pyramid of Giza, the oldest of the seven wonders of the ancient world, and the only one that's still standing actually, had an original height of 146.5 meters and a base that measured 230.4 meters on each side. How much stone to the nearest tenth was used in the construction if the pyramid was to be solid? So here we're talking about the outside and the inside, which means it's a volume question. So we're dealing with a pyramid, and we have a height of 146.5 meters. And we also have a length and a width, they're the same, of 230.4 meters. So the formula to find the volume of a pyramid is one-third length times width times height. So my length is 230.4, but the width is actually the same thing. In the question here, it says on each side, so we're assuming that the base of this pyramid is a square. So my width is 230.4 as well, and the height is 146.5. So I can multiply those numbers together. So I'll have 1 over 3 times 230.4. times 230.4 again. And then I can multiply that by 146.5. And that gets me a really big number, so 2,592,276, rather, 0.48 cubic meters. And if we round that to the nearest tenth, we would end up with 2,592,276.5 meters cubed.